Kai Graham is stepped down as as manager of Rangers. He's he's walked away. He's he's quit, and I don't blame him. The way it's been going, the last month or so, is being less than professional on the, the board and the the owners part at Rangers. Um, okay, yeah, he's had a couple of defeats to Celtic. They were quite heavy, but can, can you expect anything else at this point in time? And when your opposition manager and Brendan Rodgers are saying, yeah, they th- they treat him like garbage, that says something about how this club is run when your most hated rivals are saying, yeah, you treated him like shit. Yeah, it says something. And I will say this to Rangers fans, do you think Gerrard's going to do better with even less youth coaching experience than Murty has had? At least Murty's been caretaker manager before and actually sat in the dugout as first team coach. Gerrard's got even less coaching experience and Graham Murphy has. He may be a bigger name in football as a player, as a coach, very unproven, and this could be yet another willing, young, talented coach who's thrown into, you know, the, the bottomless pit that is Rangers and has their career derailed because of it. Um, there's other issues with Rangers. They've never, I mean, the, the, the last 15 years at Rangers has been nothing short of scandalous, both on and off the field. Yeah, we could discuss the issues with Scottish football and we can do that on live stream tonight. Um, because, you know, what what I've been saying is you need more money than just, you need more clubs than just Celtic and possibly Rangers and Aberdeen to compete for the title to make it a healthy, competitive, fun league to watch because fans staying away. The clubs have, are not competitive in Europe. The national side is not competitive in international competitions. It's a declining league. Fan gate receipts down. Fans are staying away from, from, from watching their clubs play. It's all the same thing. And when you've got a club like Rangers treating someone of the standing of Graham Murphy like absolute dog shit, it's not a good advert for the league. It makes the league look really unprofessional really unprofessional I wouldn't be surprised if Graham Murphy never coaches in Scotland ever again because of experience at Rangers he probably thinks I'm at it I'm, I'm more suited to English football I'm done as a coach thanks thank you for ruining my career Rangers I really appreciate that because um, he's, he's, had, he's had a very good um, record as a youth coach and developing young players is a problem that Scottish football has right now. And if he's forced to walk away from the game because of how Rangers have treated him and the experience he's had, well done Rangers, you've, you've, you've added to the problem that football already has. But I'm going to leave that there. He's, uh, it dep- opinions divided. Okay, yeah, he probably wasn't the best choice as manager, but he was the only guy willing to do it, it seems. Um, being undermined by the, the board and the, and the chairman pretty much constantly. Um doesn't help and the media haven't helped either so he had he was it was never gonna end, end well and I, I worry for Gerard as well having possibly you know the same things happened to him but anyway thank you very much for watching uh, please like subscribe place the comments below and I'll have uh, some more videos for you soon and when you actually do place the comments below I want to hear opinions from any Scottish football fans and not just Rangers fans so adios see you soon and uh, ta-ta